Eva and Heather have come to make their marriage vows in the presence of God and of this assembly. The uniting of this man and this woman in heart, body, and mind is intended by God for their mutual joy, for the help and comfort they give one another in prosperity and adversity, and that their love may be a blessing to all whom they encounter. Let us now witness their promises to each other and surround them with our prayers, giving thanks to God for the gift of marriage and asking God's blessing upon them that they may be strengthened for their life together and nurtured in the love of God. Heber, will you receive Heather as your wife and bind yourself to her in the covenant of marriage? Will you promise to love and honor her in true devotion, to rejoice with her in times of gladness, to grieve with her in times of sorrow, and to be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? If so, please say, I will. I will. Heather, will you receive Keeper as your husband and by, bind yourself to him in the covenant of marriage? Will you promise to love and honor him in true devotion, to rejoice with him in times of gladness, to grieve with him in times of sorrow, and to be faithful to him as long as you both shall live? If so, please say, I will. I will. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of my love and faithfulness. As a sign of my love and faithfulness. That's it. Keeper. Keeper. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of my love and faithfulness. As a sign of my love and faithfulness. It is my pleasure and my privilege to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Keeper and Heather Bartell. feelings of happiness I get when I'm around her, I cannot describe. Heather is more than I could have ever hoped for, and I love her dearly. For those of you that know me really, really well, you know I love to travel and experience new adventures, and there's no other person in the whole entire world that I'd rather go on another adventure with than Kiefer. And that Kiefer managed to find uh, a very intelligent, warm, and very funny companion that compliments him the way that my wife compliments me and from one brother to another that is the greatest feeling you can have i can see how happy keeper makes you and i know how happy you make him love that's what i see between the two of you together your kindness and your love will only continue to grow but oh my dear our love is here to stay Together we're going a long, long way In time the Rockies may crumble, Gibraltar may tumble They're only made of clay But how long
Well, I told you I'm going to be 95 next week. I've had a very happy life, and my husband and I enjoyed 61 years. But one of the things that we did from the time we were married, we had a date night every week. And it was on Thursday night, and we walked down to the pasture, or we went and got an ice cream cone, or we made popcorn. We couldn't afford very much, but for our 61 years, we pretty much did something on our date night on Thursday night. Hi, Heather and Kiefer. I love you both to the moon and back, to infinity. Okay, I'm going to try not to cry, but um, you know, Heather, you took a long time to get here. Your dad and I were married for five years before you arrived on this earth, and you know what? You are just and always just the most perfect daughter a mom could ask for. And I think we had to wait for that perfection. And uh, it was definitely worth waiting for. And that's what I see in you getting married now as an older bride to Kiefer. You waited for perfection. Kiefer, you got a lot to hold up to to, to be that perfect uh, soulmate for her. But I know you have made her happy and she seems very, very happy. And um, I, w I hope that today both of you love each other less than you did yesterday, or excuse me, more than you did yesterday and less than you will tomorrow. And that you have many, many years of wedded bliss. I love you, love you, love you. Hi, Heather and Kiefer. We are Hello. so happy to be here with you both on this beautiful day. The wedding was gorgeous and the reception is going to be the same. Beautiful bride and groom. Advice up to you. Advice? Get a smoker. If you like get to grill, smoker. get a smoker. <laughs> he probably already have one. He probably does. He's got the green egg. He That's right. The green yeah. egg. It's very good to go. Best um, of luck. Best of luck. Yes. Congratulations. Best wishes for a beautiful future together. Love you guys. Amen. Hi. We love you guys very much. And um, congratulations, Heath and <laughs> Heather and Keeper. Um, some good advice. Some good advice. Um, <laughs> that sounds like Keeper. You already know. You know, just let her do what she wants, and you'll be just fine. That's a good idea. Good idea. Yeah. I like always that works. Idea. Always works for us. <laughs> She's always right, Kiefer. Believe that. <laughs> Kiefer, Heather, this is your Uncle Fred. As Heather well knows, Kiefer, you will well know me later. Um, something that's worked for me all my life. It's not a real good plan, but it's worked so far. Die with the lie. Die with the lie. God bless both you kids. Good evening. I'm done. Hi, Heather and Kiefer. Congratulations. I'm so happy for you. Love you. Okay. Hey, Kiefer and Heather, I wish you all the best. And what I wanted, my advice to you is always iron out your wrinkles. When you have problems, you've got to iron them out. Sometimes when you, you get up and it doesn't start right in the day, you just got to give each other a hug and say, hey, let's start over. That's how you're going to make this work. And, just wish you all the best and keep loving each other. It's Uncle Jim. We'll see you. This is for Heather <laughs> and Kiefer. <laughs> Heather and Kiefer. <laughs> Go ahead. We got married 22 years ago today here. So we'll never forget your anniversary. We yeah. hope you can do something fun on your 22nd anniversary too. Thank you. I go to a cool wedding at the Plumber House. <laughs> Love you guys. Love you. Uh, marriage advice. It's okay to go to bed angry. Just get up the next day and apologize. It's important to always know that your opinion matters, but there is a point where you have to respect what the other person is also saying. That's the give and take of marriage. And that will hold you together a lot longer than any argument will separate you. Uh, best of luck. Love you much. Heather and Kiefer, your wedding was beautiful. And I know how much Heather loves to travel, so I definitely think you need to make a point to travel every single year somewhere amazing that you've never been before. So that's our advice for you, is to keep traveling, keep loving each other, and going to new places. Congratulations. And just enjoy every day and what it has to offer. 
<laughs> okay, my advice to you, Keeper and Heather, is to keep it real, keep it real good. Here's to you. Oh my god! <laughs> we just wanted to give you this little bit of advice, Kiefer and Heather. Tyler, I want you to do it. Thanks for the hot John. Well, I hey, wrote it, so. Lots of years and love and happiness to you guys. We love you guys. Thanks for letting us share the special day with you. You know, you say something. Say something. Not sentimental. Now you say okay. something. Yeah, yeah um, not sentimental. <laughs> you know, just enjoy every day, right? That's what it's all about. And if you figure anything out that I don't know, let me know. All right, the Cadillac girls, we wish you guys love, and just remember to always say goodnight before you go to bed, and, and we love you guys. It was a beautiful wedding. Congratulations. <laughs> so, Kiefer, my advice to you, listen to Heather. Sorry. Kiefer and Heather, I think uh, you guys are a great couple. Um, the first time that I met both of you together, I knew that uh, you guys were going to be perfect for each other. Uh, so I wish you the best. Best wishes. Congratulations, Kiefer and Heather. We love you guys and we wish you the best. Good job. All right. See, I'm pretty sober.